It seems to me as if there's um, a greater respect and interest in indigenous cultures, um, interfaith cultures, kind of a synthesizing of a different perspective on spirituality this, these days. And um, I, I agree with you that uh, kind of a distancing from dogma, things that are rigid, um, uh, being told how to be religious, how to pray. Um, and I, I think too, what do you think about um, the impact of social media um, in these times? Um, you know, our cultures around the world, instant communication, sharing of ideas. Um, do you notice a change with uh, Well, it certainly changed our lives. Uh, we're very much involved with social media and connecting with others around the world uh, with like beliefs. Uh, there is a divine love movement. It's very small, uh, but very uh, intense and dedicated in those efforts to pray for divine love and to share the wonderful experiences and news of the new birth, as it's called. And there are websites, quite a few of them actually, that share this message. And uh, it has changed in as much as the barriers of physicality, uh, distances between all of us in the world are crumbling. And we're able to communicate with one another on a daily basis all around the world. And I think this is starting to facilitate an opening up of different spiritual perspectives and understandings and sharing individual experiences because ultimately in my uh, point of view spirituality is a personal thing it's a personal experience and the more we can share with one another and find the commonalities in that experience and in our thinking then we are supporting one another in a, in a form of fellowship that hopefully is not going to uh, get boxed up in dogma and uh, limited thinking, mm -hmm. but is inclusive. 